our second day here, Columbia Gorge. Uh, we are on historical Columbia River Highway. It's very pretty right now. A little bit of a sun, uh, but super windy and cold. Yep, and we're at the Rowena's Crest Viewpoint. It's really pretty, but again, uh, really cold up here. There's still snow around on the mountains. Um, so we're gonna head down the rest of the Highway 30 uh, on our way to our 197 to go down the bend. And uh, yeah, that's it. We're driving. We stopped and had breakfast right next to our hotel, in the hotel, basically. Yep, on the first floor of the hotel. Yep. It was very good Nordic breakfast. And very healthy. Well, yours was healthy. Mine was less so. Right. But it was still really yummy. Uh, and then we got some coffee and we headed out. So we're heading down the road. We are fortunate enough to have some uh, partly cloudy skies and it's not, it was raining this morning, but it's all cleared up. So we're looking forward to maybe having some good views on the way down the bend. See you later. S signing off. side trip, skipping lunch so that we can make it, eating some uh, granola bars and, and leftover scones. And then, uh, yeah, we're going to uh, go to check out the beds and then hopefully be in bed for dinner. But it's really beautiful out here. Like oh, right yeah. Now, the green hills we're driving through are just beautiful. So A lot of rolling hills, windy roads. And zero cell reception, so we have no idea how far or close we are. Yeah. <laughs> to where we're going. Because Google deleted all my offline Oregon maps. So, yep. That's too bad. But yeah, we're, we're heading over and we'll check back in probably later when we get closer to bed. It'll probably be dark by then. Bye. So yeah, so we were we went to the John Day fossil beds, and we realized Painted Hills weren't near there. Uh, we couldn't tell because Google didn't have our offline map, maps available. And so now we are doing the loop to go to Painted Hills, and we're hoping to get there before sunset. Um, so we're doing the long loop, and we're hoping to get there before sunset, and then we'll 
end up in Bend later in the evening. It's a really long drive because the roads are all super windy. So we're expecting to get to Painted Hills a little before four. And it's uh, what, just after three right now. And it's not even that far of a drive, it's 38 miles. So, but it's a nice drive, it's really pretty, but we've seen a total of maybe six cars on the road in the last two and a half hours. I think it's been like two and a half hours, so. Yeah, it's, uh, it's pretty interesting, but it's really pretty and uh, lots of going over passes. We just went over a pass, it was almost 3,800 feet. So lots of up and downs and beautiful, like right in front of us right now, we have this incredible canyon in front of us with hills and all that kind of stuff. So we're, we're, we're pretty happy about it. We're just a little worried we won't make any time for sunset. Yeah, well, we, we also stopped by Faso for lunch. Um, the place called Blanda's Blessings. A uh, pretty good sandwich, pretty good pasta salad. Um, reasonable price. And we went to the mercantile store, got some snacks. And they had all kinds of interesting old stuff, like a really old till for cashing out stuff, and a bunch of dead deer heads. That seems to be the trend around here. But well, that's what you get when you're in the woods. So, okay, we're gonna sign off. We might do another update. We'll definitely do an update when we get to Bend, but uh, we might or might not do an update after we do Painted Hills. Depends how tired we are. Or, yeah, or how focused we are. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Hi, okay, so we uh, just got done getting dinner at Chomp Chomp. We've been in Bend for a little bit. We ended up coming back in the dark. Uh, we did make it to Painted Hills right at sunset. So we got a few photos. We're not sure if they're any good. And then, um, yeah, we ran into some snow and ice going over one of the passes on the way back. Scary. It was, that well, wasn't too bad. It at was least scary. It wasn't quite dark yet. Uh, we saw some deer, but luckily none jumped in front of us, so we're good there. Um, so yeah, so we made it back. We're in our room. Uh, it's a pretty big area here. We can't see outside. We have a, a quote-unquote river view. Yeah. So we'll see in the morning, probably. But for right now, we have a fireplace that we don't know if it works or not. 
it looks like it's a real fireplace, but we know, don't know how it works. And then a really big room. We've got a little balcony, and then we've got two queen beds, and then a ton of space. We actually have a vanity sink for doing makeup for some reason. And then we'll do a quick little tour. We've got a little mini kitchen here. Oops, a little mini kitchen, a little entryway, and then just a regular old bathroom. That's it. <laughs> Signing off, Millie decided to hide in the closet, so we'll see if she ever comes back out. Bye.